Hello, welcome to my Dan Computer Training Channel. We're so pleased that you joined us to learn something beautiful. In this tutorial, our attention will be focusing on how to save a document in an alternative file format. Save a document in an alternative file format. Uh, let's make use of this. Um, we used this document in our last tutorial, but let's discuss about it. Take for example, I want to save this document in an alternative file format. Well, 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 we may need to know about why do we need to use alternative file format. In some cases, you may be sending a file to someone and you find out that the person you are sending to is unable to open the document because when he made effort to open you, it will receive a notification like um, file not supported. All right. Or oh, this file cannot be read. Oh. Or this cannot this file cannot be opened with this device and many more so it will be wise for you to actually save a file like that in the uh, alternative file format that will make it easier for this person's to read. take for example maybe why sometimes maybe you be using it as a plain text plain text plain text will have the um, the file name extension T uh, XT or maybe you want to save it as um, rich text format. That one is uh, actually .rtf. Or maybe you may choose to send the file to the person uh, as a PDF, that is portable document format, so that whenever you he receive that, it will be easy for him to read, or it will be easy for him to open with his own device. So how do you do that? Kindly take your cursor down to the file. When you come to the save as, after clicking on the save as browse, choose a location of your choice to which you would like it to be saved. After choosing that, come down to save as type. Save as type. You could choose take for example. We make mention about PDF. You could choose. Okay. Let's just choose PDF for example. We choose a PDF after deciding on what name to give and the location to which you want it to be. You can just come down to the bottom right and click on save. After clicking on save, what will happen is that this document will be saved to the desktop with as a copy of a PDF. You can see it here a PDF copy. So, whenever this person receives this in his own device, it will be easier for him to open. So, that can be much helpful and time saving and actually can assist the other persons and you yourself to get along well. I hope you enjoyed the short tutorial. So, that is how we save a document in an alternative file format. If you do, please smash that subscribe button, share this video. Thank you. See you in the next video.